So last week I made a video talking about the Martha is dead quote controversy. Uh, Sony has a right to censor whatever they want. It's a private company. Uh, they chose to make non-interactive a sequence where a player cuts off the face of a dead woman and then wears it on her face. Okay. And, you know, whatever. I mean, I, I, I've talked about it. I'm going to play it on PC or Xbox. Sony can do what they want. I think it's stupid. Whatever. But, you know, I thought that was the end of it for me. And it is. I mean, it's not like I'm going to protest. It's their company. But I got to just show you some horse shit real quick. Because I'm playing um, Cyberpunk uh, 2077. I'm enjoying it. It's not what this video is about. But I'm, I'm digging it. It's good. The new update. And I'm walking around and I, you know, I took down some bad guys over here, um, you know, that were attacking this person who killed somebody and I got there too late, but I killed the bad guys. And as I'm driving away, I see this poster here. Okay. This now, I don't think Sony should censor anything, frankly, other than things like, you know, like we've talked about, like if, if, if something's harming children, that's different. Other than that, I think games are an art form. I think if you rate it the way you want to rate it, uh, and, and Sony agrees and the ESRB agrees, you know, go with God. Do what you want to do. Uh, don't show it to kids necessarily, but it's an M-rated title, right? So I don't have a problem with this. But what I have a problem with is, you know, 70 people per day in America, according to the CDC, kill themselves with guns. Suicide with guns, right? Um, the number of people per day in America that cut off someone's face or even murder someone and then cut off the face of the dead body and then wear it, I think it's pretty little. I think it's low, maybe eight per day, but it's certainly not 70 per day, which is what we have with the suicide rates. Do you know Cyberpunk 2077, which is this game, before this update release, this is, you know, months ago, has sold almost 14 million copies. It is one of the best-selling RPGs of all time. It is hyped. It is marketed. The number of people, and chances are, you know, impressionable people, kids, uh, who get the game even though it has an M on it, that see this is going to be massive. Uh, the number one best-selling walking simulating simulator horror game, which is what, uh, uh, Martha is Dead is is called Layers of Fear I believe it's like Resident Evil's horror but I, I mean like walking sim horror uh, Team Bloober's Layers of, Layers of Fear has done about 2 million copies maybe more 2 to 3 million copies at this point okay came out in 2017 the number of people who are going to play Martha is Dead uh, compared to the number of people who are going to see this compared to this being an actual effective piece of horrible this happens in the real world and don't trigger anybody which again i don't think you should censor it i'm just saying that whoever's sitting there at sony pulling the levers and making decisions about this shit um you're out of your goddamn mind you don't know what the fuck you're doing your heart is probably in the right place maybe but this is out there this is one of the most successful games in the genre of all time that's okay put a gun in your mouth why not I bring it up because it's so infuriating. You don't really care, Sony, Xbox, P whoever does the censoring. I'm just not an anti-Sony thing. This is just, in, in this case, they're in the crosshairs because th they're the latest with Martha's Dead. But either actually care or just shut the fuck up about it and stop, you know, people know what you're doing. Stop dodging the political PR bullets and actually care. If you care, then you would have a conversation about this as well. And I don't think you should because games are art. But you come off at worst like uh, horrible, uncaring, all about the money hypocrites. And at best, you just come off as, as kind of confused about what's actually uh, a real threat to the world and what is just silly uh, horror, horror shit. I hope you're well. See you soon. Bye.